Hey guys, just got a short little um, kind of really kind of sort of PSA video. So if you were building lots of conveyor belts, we weren't really sure how it worked, but it uh, seems like now we kind of know. I had a guy coming to my stream saying that he was having similar uh, issues with his belts like I was having with Mark 6. So it seems like it's not actually in fact Mark 6 belts that are laggy. So when I place a Mark 6 belt, you get that big lag spike, right? You place a Mark 5 belt, you don't get a lag spike. So we were originally thinking that it's because of the transparency, the different model on this, yada, yada, yada. When in fact, it must have more to do with the calculations and how many you have of them than actually the model of the belt itself. So what I did was I loaded my save uh, back when it was significantly smaller. So this save is about 30 megabytes large and there is about 1500 kilometers of Mark VI belts. And as you'll see with the Mark VI belts, when you place them, you get that lag and that stutter. When you place the Mark V and any other belt, you don't get any lag at all. So what I did is I loaded my save into the calculator and I converted or downgraded all of the belts to Mark V. And what you'll see is the Mark V belts will now lag exactly like the Mark VI belts did and the Mark VI belts will not lag at all. So it would seem that best practice would be to, um, I mean, it's nice to just be able to, and this is how I've always built and I'm somewhat regretting it now, but just built using the max tier belt because of convenience. Um, and I guess the reality of it is it also, I, I, it's probably not worth looking too much into that because at the end of the day, you're not going to have that many belts. The majority of your belt lining will come from if you're doing massive conveyor belt buses. Um, so realistically to me, it almost seems like if you were to be wanting to play around a conveyor belt uh, based uh, play, um, you would want to probably have a mod that could make all of your Mark V belts Mark VI speed. So that way you could, for example, make this huge mega uh, belt bus out of air quote Mark V belts that are moving at, at Mark VI speeds. And then when you're just building in your base with Mark VI belts, they then don't lag. That would seem like probably the best option um, for now. I guess hopefully now that we've kind of found this maybe we'll be we can be hopeful that I mean, in 1.1 they can maybe get this fixed but yeah like it like I said look so now now mark six belts don't lag at all and if I build with mark five belts we get that same kind of stuttering and lag and again this is a uh, 30 megabyte file size uh, with about 1500 kilometers of now Mark Mark five belts. Uh, I could maybe look into my uh, previous saves at like different belt lengths. It seems like probably when you get to around a thousand kilometers or so, I'd say is when it's really starts uh, being noticeable. Obviously this is 1500 and it is ex incredibly noticeable. Um, uh, the hologram change that they came out with in 1.0.5 was pretty, pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I feel like I can almost probably play with, with, with shadows on and it's hardly any noticeable compared to low. So that's pretty big, pretty big in my opinion, because playing with low shadows is pretty yikes. So big ups to them for uh, getting that hologram issue sorted. That's pretty big performance wise, but now the issue, and I hope they address it. Um, because again, it's the, the, the play style that I choose the, the, and I like the most. I don't really like doing trains and stuff like that. I like just doing big mega belts and uh, long conveyor belt buses. So, but again, this is just a quick PSA. So Mark six belts are not actually the problem. And it is just whatever belt you have built the most of. And I would assume that if I had a save with 
1500 kilometers of mark 6 belts and 1500 kilometers of mark 5 belts then they would probably both perform the exact same way so just a short video i just wanted to show this um come check out the stream we are working on nuclear uh we'll put a video out on that when we're done we're getting all the uranium from the entire map doing nuclear up here we're gonna have like 200 nuclear reactors it's uh i'm droning everything in it's pretty cool uh thanks for watching the short video though guys take it easy